We will be doing algebra. Mrs. Allison, may I use the bathroom? Sure. But hurry up, I have a class to teach you now. Thanks. Oh God, I should not have eaten Chinese takeout for breakfast. I need to go to the bathroom. Coast is clear. I am going to change my vocal cords to sound like the principal, and then make a fake lockdown. Ow, pulling and hitting my vocal cords hurt as hell. But anyways, let's do this. Attention, Attention students, students, this, this is, is not, not a drill. drill. There, there is, is a robber inside, inside the building. building. We, are we are now going, going to go, go into, into lockdown. lockdown. Teachers, Teachers, lock, lock your, your doors, doors right, right now. Students, get, get under your, your desks immediately. immediately. This, this is a great emergency. The police, FBI, and SWAT are coming as fast as they can. In the meantime, don't make a peep. Be absolutely silent. We are doing all we can to keep all your animated students safe. Loosening my vocal cords feels so much better. Rosie scared, 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 scared. Rosie, I know you're very scared, but please try to be very quiet, like the principal said. Kid, what are you doing in the hallway with a robber in here? Get in my classroom now. I'm sorry that all of the desks are taken, but you can hide behind the bookshelf over there. This, this is, is Officer, Officer Buckle, Buckle to, to notify you that, that this lockdown, lockdown was, was a false alarm. alarm. Students and, and staff, staff, listen to exactly what, what I'm going, going to say. say. This, this lockdown, lockdown is not over and we are, are making a student evacuation. Staff, line, line up, up your students at the north entrance, section by section. We have notified your parents for release. We will find the student who made this prank. Called you in here? Oh, never mind. Our cameras have sound now. They caught you pulling your vocal cords like mine and fake a lockdown. We are going to have to call your parents. You are suspended from this school for two months. No, please take off my suspension. I'm sorry, kid, but rules are the rules. Hello, Mrs. Anderson. Your daughter Viley has just faked a lockdown and terrorized the whole school. Please pick her up. Thank you. Bye. Your mother is coming to pick you up right now. Let's go home right now, Viley. Mom, are you angry? Angry doesn't even explain the damage caused to the school. I can't believe you got suspended from school for creating a fake lockdown. Do you know that could have gotten you arrested? I'm sorry, Mom. It was all supposed to be a harmless prank. No. Harmless? Are you kidding me? You terrorized the whole school. Everyone thought that there was a robber in the school. When we get home, we will watch the news. Oh yeah, you're definitely watching. But, watch. Today on GNN, a local school terrorized after a student faked a lockdown. Welcome to the Advise Show, media, with the common sense of those. Gonna made school had to shut down early because a stupid idiot broke into the principal's office and faked a lockdown. Side of right now, I am in the abandoned school hallway with three interviewers. The first is the principal of the school. Now, would you like to share your story? Yes. Viley broke into my office while I was in the bathroom and faked a lockdown, saying a robber broke into the school. And Viley, if you are watching this, I changed my mind about your suspension. You're expelled from this school and will be given a restraining order from this school. If you step 100 feet from this school, you will be arrested. Now we have Elena Marquez, a parent of a traumatized second grader. Now share your story to the viewers. Whoever you are, Billy, you have my daughter Dora traumatized, locked in her room crying. She is now in a mental institution and goes to physical therapy because of you. Our family is never the same now. I just wanted you to know that. You and your family will be paying a $900,000 hospital bill.
Thanks Slap for raising her pony. We always have fights and cry and give out let of punishments now. Our family will never be the same again. Now we have one more interviewer, Andrew Orozco. So Andrew, tell your story. Well, I was in language arts class until the intercom came on and I had faith to lockdown. I was so scared. And, would you allow this type of behavior in your house? Absolutely not. Whoever dares to come in my house and fakes a lockdown will get broken ankles. I'm coming for you, Viley. Wait, Andrew. Calm down. We can talk this out. We seem to be encountering some technical difficulties. Please stand by. And Miley, you will be paying for the damages of the camera. I can't believe we have all these bills to pay. You are in so much trouble. I heard our troublemaker was all over the news. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you. A mother said we raised her daughter poorly and now we have to pay her $900,000 hospital bill. Oh my god, Viley. How dare you do all this? That's IT. You are grounded for a year. Go to your room now. To meet Sonic Popper again.